guys. Oh, I hate starting videos. It's the worst part of making a video. Carrie's Christmas Book Club box. The December box is here. I was trying to think of a Christmassy box. Last year we had uh, the Christmas Carol, Charles Dickens' Christmas Carol. And this year I decided to go for a book where it's always winter, but never Christmas. 10 Hogwarts house points, if you know what that's from without me having to tell you, but I'm gonna tell you anyway. It's The Lion, the Witch and the Wardrobe, which is one of my all time favorite books. So I thought it'd be perfect to have a book based around this box and some of the things we have in the box are really, really cool. First thing I'm gonna tell you about that's in the box, I don't have with me because I ate it. It's one of those Turkish Delight chocolate bar things that you can buy in the shops. They look like this. They're in like the little purple shiny wrappers. And Turkish Delight is one of the things that it's like one of my Christmas traditions. I can't have Christmas without Turkish Delight. Mmm. Christmas isn't Christmas if it doesn't smell like Christmas tree everywhere all the time. So we've added in this little Christmas tree scented essential oil that you can put in little oil burners and stuff. And I have a fake Christmas tree, so this is perfect for me because now it just smells like I have a real Christmas tree. Which is kind of the only reason I would get a real Christmas tree, just for that Christmassy smell. Also isn't Christmas without lots and lots of hot chocolate. So we've added in a hot chocolate stirring spoon, so you just put this into hot milk and stir it around and then it just melts into the hot milk and it's just so good. Of course, as always, there's the bookmark, which is always appropriately designed. But the coolest thing in the box, in my personal opinion, is this. <laughs> it's a create your own Christmas decoration kit. And I've just remembered that I unpacked everything out of their little plastic packages and now I've just spun the box round. So they've all just fallen out. Okay, good. There's little hearts, little wooden hearts. There's little wooden stars, there's bells, and there's lots of different little bits, like bit, different bits of string and little like cord things to put your decorations up on, and there's beads, and there's pegs, I dropped the pegs, and then there's like ribbons, which I'm gonna have a lot of fun playing with. When I have created some beautiful slash disastrous Christmas decorations, I shall post pictures of them on Twitter slash Instagram. The other exciting thing that I have to tell you about is thehopefulshop.com. Lots of people have been asking if new merchandise is going to be added. I am wearing said new merchandise. Yeah, yeah, polka dot t-shirts. So this is one of my favorite things that is on the hopeful shop at the moment because it's just a polka dot t-shirt. It says it's way past my bedtime, like under the collar bit at the back. But aside from that, it's just a polka dot t-shirt and no one has to know that it's related to me or my channel. It's just a really cool polka dot t-shirt. Along with spiral backpacks, which are also polka dotted and then the other t-shirt that we've got on the shop is like white with the word hopeful written all over it and we have another backpack that matches that and they're so pretty they are made by spiral backpacks and we collaborated with them to make these amazing cool rucksacks and i love them so much but the final thing that's being added to the hopefulshop.com it's so cool, and I can't believe we've actually had this made specifically for the Hopeful Shop, but it's a necklace. It's a necklace that says Hopeful, and it's so pretty, and I wore it to work the other day, and it's so comfortable to wear, and I just love it. And again, it's just one of those things that no one will know that it's related to me or my channel or these videos, but will secretly be in the know. Just cool things that I wanted to exist just because, and now they exist. And now we can all have them and be happy. Oh! I just wanted to add, everything that I've talked about in this video, you don't have to get it. You don't have to get it if you don't want it. If you don't get it right now or ever, it doesn't make you more or less of a fan or a, I hate the word fan, but I can't think of any other word to use in place of it at the moment. It doesn't make you any more or less of a person who enjoys my videos. That's how I'm gonna phrase that. It just makes you a person who doesn't have a polka dot t-shirt. <laughs> That's kind of it. And so like all of this stuff is just there in case you want it. And if you don't, that's cool. But I wanted it to exist in the world and therefore it does. That's kind of all there is to it. So Merry Christmas. <laughs> I'm also really crap at ending videos we have just discovered. <laughs> Dear Tom and 
OMG, this Sunday I went to go and visit the wonderful Linda Blacker for a photo shoot. I have admired her work for ages, so when she got in touch and asked me if I wanted to work on a fairy tale esque photo shoot with her, I absolutely jumped at the chance. 